How's it going, guys? You by TCG, and we have a really cool opening today. We'll be opening up a bunch of random packs. We got a mini box of uh, 25th Anniversary Legendary Collection. We got six Styberstorm Access, six Amazing Defenders. There are six packs in here, right? I'm not stupid. Yes. Okay. I want to make sure we had an even number. And then we have a, this is the big thing. We have a 2006 Booster Pack Collector's Tin. I don't remember what comes in this. I mean, I know we get a promo. But actually, let me pull up. Uh, the card list so we can see that i'll be right back all right we're back i just want to make sure we know what's in here there's actually gonna be cybernetic revolution elemental energy shadow of infinity duels pack jade and yugi duels pack Chaz princeton and expert edition volume three and then we have the uh the steam healer elemental Hero steam healer in here as well which is a promo which we couldn't get the promo out last time but it was because um it's really actually simple well I say it's simple. There you go. So let's see how this one looks as far as... So the front looks really good. The back actually looks pretty insane. Man, that's a gradable card. Let me grab a sleeve for that. What an amazing looking card, though. Sick pull. Obviously, it's a guarantee, but... I mean, these tins are pretty amazing. So I think it is six packs. Let me, now I'm trying to remember. Is it six or is it five? Me... Yep, yeah, it's six packs, which is perfect. So open up. Man, that package is very damaged. That sucks. Uh, what order? Probably like, probably do it in that order. I'd say that's probably... The duelist packs are kind of mid. You don't really care about the duelist packs. But the tin, obviously, so cool. We opened up the 07. So we'll have to keep doing this, actually, because maybe we'll eventually open up all of them. That'd be really cool. So start with Amazing Defenders, though. We still have not pulled a collector out of this set, so maybe today can be the day. This is out of Fresh Booster Box. And it'll be a super out of the first one. Pretty typical of that set. Cyberstorm Access. Haven't hit a Starlight yet out of this, but haven't opened up much. So but we'll be doing... Actually, the case probably have already happened. So maybe we did pull a Starlight. This is being filmed before we do the live stream next week. Or technically it would be already happened. You know what I mean. Oh, so we got Numbers Evil. So we got an Ultra Rare. Nice. This is out of a fresh booster box as well. All right, come on, Dark Crisis. This set has been very good to us, honestly. So maybe we can get, I don't, do we have both secrets? I think we only have just one out of the set so far. We have the better one at least. And we got Arsenal Robber. So nothing crazy out of that one. Right, let's go into Duelist Pack Yugi. I honestly, I'm trying to think, what can you even pull out of this set? Or Dulce Pack, Jaden, Yuki, not Jules Pack, Yugi. I'm used to saying that, though, because we do open a lot of that. These cards are very sticky. Burst in a tricks. And, oh. In a, uh, oh my god, what is the name of that card? Why am I forgetting that? Hold on. How can I not remember this card? I do have the card list, though, so we can find it real fast. How do I forget that one? Negate attack. Oh my god, I can't believe that. God, these cards do feel so good, though. Love the uh, Japanese printing of the cards. They just feel so good. All right, we'll go back into Amazing Defenders. Let me go back, actually. All right. I want to at least have the card list up, because I can't remember them all the time. So, again, nothing out of uh, Amazing Defenders. Pretty common. Pull nothing out of that set, I feel like. Let's see. We've got Tri Brigade Roar. We already hit an Ultra out of this set, so not super surprising to hit a Super now. Hopefully one of these Legendary Collections can also give us something good. On top of the tin, because tin... Or that's where we're really hoping to get the good cards out of anyways. Oh, this will be a hit. 
Beast of Tall War. We have not pulled that one yet. Very cool looking card. Very good ultra. <clears throat> All right, let's go into Duel's Pack. Chaz Princeton. I probably should have done them in a different order, but hey, whatever. I don't think either one of these really have great cards in them. This actually might be a hollow. Yeah, nope, it is a rare, but still really cool. I was hoping we get one big hit out of um, these. Out of the Japanese box, just one good hit would be, ooh, can we finally get a collector rare out of this set? And we get Rescue Ultra Rare. Should have known. I don't know why. I can't hit collector rares out of that set at all. But Maze of Memories, I've, I mean, I have had, I've hit collector rares out of that set, but only because I opened a case. Otherwise, I wouldn't have one. We got Gold Pride Pinballer. So two ultra rares. That's actually pretty good out of the set. All right, let's see. So we got October Sir, Great Cooper Servant, Boar Soldier, Snake Fang. Send you the ten thousand hands. Okay, that's the so this is the original art of this card. And this is the one they did for the TCG. I do prefer the Lost Art, not going to lie. We got Sonic Bird. Right, there's a lot of cards in this Expert Edition. A lot of cards in here, damn. All right, so we got an Avion to start and a Common. Um, oh, my God. What is that? How can I know the name of this card? Am I really that stupid? Well, today we are. Man, it's like you're almost, it feels like you're going to get a hollow because they're so sticky together. I wonder how this works. In the English, we would have known we were not getting a monster hollow in the, uh, like when they've done sets like this. Okay, this actually might be a hollow. And we got Karibo, or Wing Karibo. Very cool. I'll take that. At least we got a hit out of it. All right, we do have some really sick packs to left to go in that tin. Let's see if uh, Amazing Defenders can finally do something and more super airs. I'd probably say Amazing Defenders. It's not my least favorite set. I mean, that goes to Fist of the Gadgets, but... I'm not a big Amazing Defenders fan. I feel like that set has just never gives me anything. We got S Force Night Chaser. So just a super rare out of Savage Maxis that time. All right, we're going to IOC. We have not gotten really anything great out of IOC except for Invader of Darkness. So hopefully we can hit something good out of here eventually. We got Tower of Babel. So nothing again out of IOC. <clears throat> Let's go into Shadows of Infinity. If we can hit the ultimate rare out of this set, that would be pretty crazy. But I think they're all good. It's basically you get... That's pretty cool. Uh, you basically get... I think the only ultimates are the... Um, uh, I got what are they called? The Sacred Beast. And then I think there's a Cyber twin dragon in this set we got nothing out of that one again we're only probably going to get maybe one hit you know it's really random I shouldn't even say it. it's not even guaranteed to even get any hits so we're doing pretty decent with at least one super rare it's got another super rare out of uh, amazing defenders though Honestly, I like the other two sets we're about to open better. Elemental Energy and Cybernetic Revolution. So if I had to pick one, I'd pick one out of those anyways. So maybe we can get a good hit out of one of those. Got Tri Brigade Roar. Actually, I think we've gotten that already today, so duplicate. All right, Metal Raiders. Let's see. We've actually hit both secrets out of this already. 
We still need Beast Skull, though. That'd be my probably most wanted card, but not today. We have at least hit one Ultra out of those. It's got Elemental Energy. I don't think it works like English. I think you can... Actually, I don't think Queen's Knight and Jack's Knight are actually ultimates in this set like they are in English, if I remember right. I know it's kind of weird. Let's see if we can get anything good out of Elemental Oh, we got a Super. I will take that. At least we got a Super Rare. They do look so good, the Japanese printings of these cards. All right, down to the last four packs. <clears throat> Not a bad tin, actually. Two hollows is pretty good. I don't think Expert Edition is guaranteed. At least I don't think it is, so. And we'll just keep doing what we do out of Amazing Defenders and pull nothing. All right, come on, Cyberstorm Access. Starlight Rare? Hopefully at least hit a secret. That'd be nice. And we got Time Machine Morganite. So no secrets out of that set today. Actually, I'd rather get a hit out of this anyway, so let's see if LLB can finally give us a hit. Not a guarantee. And the Fury Sea King. Very typical of LLB for us. We don't get a lot of hits out of that. But let's go into the last pack, which is Cybernetic Revolution. If we could pull a Cyber End Dragon Ultimate Rare, oh my god, I'd go crazy. Oh, they're upside down. Could be a good sign. And nothing out of that pack. Still really cool, though. These tins are so much fun to open because you get these sick promos. Like, look at this thing. This Steam Healer looks amazing. Ultimates do look so good, though. I love adding Ultimates to the collection, but hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe, and stay tuned for more content coming soon. Have a nice day.